Hi guys, it's Sigrid and today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of Unplugged's adult box for the month of March 2021. Super excited. I get this box every single month so if this is something that you guys want to see on a consistent basis, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Let's see what's inside. Okay, so I am seeing the spoiler card and the theme for this month was Discovery. Ooh, so the first thing I am seeing is in this gold bag. It feels a little weird. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Okay, so it's a small bottle of something. So this is the Red Rising Hand Sanitizer. Red Rising by Pierce Brown tells the story of Darrow who discovers his own value and decides to rise up and fight back against injustice. This exclusive hand sanitizing spray was made by 42,020 Visionaries, a local business that creates bath and body products and pain relief products. Use the code UNPLUG to save at their website. Hey, so the next thing I am seeing looks like some bath salts. So it says, Unplugged Book Box Rin Bath Fizzies. Oh, this is inspired by the Poppy War. If you look back, you might can see them up here. Oh, uh, yeah, right here. I have the entire series right here. But um, so this is the Poppy War Bath Fizzies. Rin from the Poppy War by R.F. Kuang discovers she has a secret power in the mystical art of shamanism. These bath fizzies can be used in a bath or for a foot soak. They are an unplugged exclusive by Sudsy Duck Soapery, a small business that makes stunning bath products. You see how they smell, right? Oh, wow. So it's really strong and has a citrus fruit smell. Yeah, it does smell like grapefruit. Yeah. Oh, that's really good. It smells so good. I can't wait to use these. I love, like... I love bath salts, so they will be used. Okay, I am seeing a giant key. What could this be? Oh, that's so cool. And it's not your typical like ballpoint. This is like fine line. Yes, finally a pen that I would like. So this is inspired by the invisible life of Addie LaRue. Oh, it comes with a notebook. So let me grab that as well. So it comes with a notebook like this. Let's see how the lines are. Okay, so this is together because this is the Invisible Life of Addie LaRue notebook and pen. Addie from V.E. Swab's novel discovers the reality of what it means to pray to the gods after dark. This notebook is an unplugged exclusive from Petrichor Inc., a small self-care business that make products inspired by books, 90s TV, and alternative music. Use the code UNPLUGGED to save in their shop cute so the cover says blink and the years fall away like leaves the eastwap so i actually read the invisible life of adelie rue um and i rated it five stars i thought it was really great i haven't really read a lot of books about people making deal with the devil to live forever so i thought it was unique but i mean maybe that's something that's done a lot who knows i haven't read anything like it i thought it was really cool and yeah i thought it was really good okay, so it looks like the next thing i am seeing is a candle so it says, Castrema smells like smoky vanilla, amber, and surviving the worst. This is by the Scented Stories Company. Oh, that does, mm, it does smell like vanilla. You guys, vanilla is my favorite scent in the whole entire world. Oh my gosh, that is so good. This is the fifth season candle. The Fifth Season by N.K. Jemison focuses on the tragedy of a family in the community as war begins to rage. This book touches on the discovery of limitation and pushing boundaries. It's an unplugged exclusive by Scented Stories Co., a small bookish candle vendor. Use the code UNPLUGGED to save on their Etsy shop. Okay, I am seeing a bookmark that says, am I hallucinating? If you were, how would asking me help? The moment I discovered magic was real was the moment I discovered myself. Oh, that's so cute. What is this? Like, what is it this, like from? The Magicians. So this is um, the Magicians bookmark. The Magicians TV show based on the novel by Lee Lev Grossman is about a group of friends that discovers magic and the dangers that comes with it. This bookmark is an unplugged exclusive featuring quotes and imagery from the show. 
I have to watch this show. I've never heard of it before. Uh, Unplugged does a photo challenge where on certain days you can take photos and tag them and I guess they'll you'll get retweets maybe, I don't know. But um, on the back of it, you have some prompts for your journal. I am seeing a letter from the author and on the back, it is a nice art print. And then I am seeing a signed book print from the author. And before we get to the book, I want to announce the themes for next month. So for the adult box, the theme is Venom. And for the YA box, which I don't do anymore, the theme is Power. Okay, so it says, Coming soon, there will be an unplugged book box exclusive for the book One Last Stop by Casey McQuinston. I actually... This book was on my wish list, so I don't know if I'm going to get this or not. I think I probably should just get the book itself instead of getting the box about it. So I'm not sure yet. Okay, and we are down to the book. This is a paperback, so I'm assuming that all of the adult boxes are paperback because I haven't gotten a hardcover paperback. Uh, I haven't gotten a hardcover book for the adult box, but I have for the YA box. So that's interesting. Okay, so the book is called The Conductors by Nicole Glover. Glover? That's so cute. And there's a black woman on the cover. So I'm already happy with this box because I feel represented and seen. Because there's a... We, you never know, though. You never know because this would be a trick. She could be like a, min, my, a minor character in this book and they're just using it so because they know we're going to buy it. Oh, okay. So let me read the backs for you guys. So it's, it's written by, oh, it's written by Author of Color. I am so happy. She's in Virginia. You guys know I'm in Maryland right now. Oh, she's so close. Oh, she likes video games. You guys ever just like look at the like bio and just be like, oh my gosh, she's like me. Okay. So let me read the synopsis. So it says, Hetty Rhodes and her husband, Benji, were conductors on the Underground Railroad, ferrying dozens of slaves to freedom with daring, cunning, and magic that draws its powers from the constellation. With the war over, those skills find a new purpose as Hetty and Benji solve mysteries and murders that white authorities would otherwise ignore. In the heart of Philadelphia's seventh ward, everyone knows that there's a strange death or magical curses are causing trouble. Hetty and Benji are the only ones who can solve the case, but when an old friend is murdered, their investigation stirs up a wasp nest of intrigue, lies, and long-buried secrets, and a mystery unlike anything they've handled before. With a clever, cold-blooded killer on the prowl, Hetty and Benji, testing their magics and placing their lives at risk, will discover how little they know about their neighbors and themselves. Dun-dun-dun-dun! Whoa! This is going to be so good, you guys. Is it? Oh, it's not signed. It has a signed book plate. I'm happy. I am super happy with this. This is a really great book to like to pick. I'm so glad that they pick a minority author. Way to go, Unplugged. Way to go. Of course, I'm going to stay subscribed to this box. Like they did really well this today. So let me just go over the gifts and say what I like definitely love the hand sanitizer like and it it doesn't even need to be said it's amazing with the journal and the pen i'm not a fan of the of the notebook because uh when i looked inside and i saw that it's like college rule i mean i saw that it's like wide lines i'm more of a college rule person and yeah and i don't like the the way that it looks this is just not my my preferred notebook but i am obsessed with this pen I am obsessed with this pan. I think it's so cute. And I love the fact that it's like a cute little key. Obsessed. Um, let's see. Love the candles. I absolutely love getting candles. And I love getting like bath products. So everything was a hit except for the notebook. So definitely happy with this box. So if you guys like this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up video. And also click subscribe because I will be unboxing this once again next month. So stay tuned until that next video. And I also unbox several others. So if you want to check out any of my other videos, feel free. But until next time, I will see you. Bye.